What's a movie you loved as a child that you now consider to be cringeworthy? Mars Needs Moms became my obsession and made my dad watch it at least twice a day with me until he hid it from me when I was 9 and told me he lost it. I watched it again holy crap. Edit. Seems I offended people. When it came to Mars Needs Moms I like it just to Connie for me personally and I hate being sad. Alvin and the Chipmunks holy shit those guys are annoying. Mac and me. Five year old me used to make my parents rent it all the time. It's now used as a joke movie for bad sci-fi. IDK if anyone said it, yet but Agent Cody Banks is pretty cringe. Used to love them as a kid, but looking at them now it's not the same as before. Swim fan. Just watch it. I don't want to spoil it, but that movie has aged so badly. Kangaroo Jack. Loved that shit. Watched it so many times as a kid. Tried to watch it as a freshman in college and had to stop after 15 minutes because the cringe levels were too high. I feel like I used to watch Garfield a lot. Didn't realize it was bad until that zombie land moment lol. This really dates me, but Mannequin was my favorite growing up. Whoa. Thank you for the awards. It really warms my heart that you all loved it to a re. The Phantom Billy Zane. Totally cheesy when I rewatched it, but loved it as a kid. Three Ninjas High Noon at Mega Mountain. Home Alone 3. I was obsessed with both of these movies as a kid. I loved all the Three Ninjas movies which are probably all not so great, but I remember that one the most, and I've heard people say it's by far the worst. And boy did I want an RC car with a camera on it to drive at ridiculously long ranges. The horror Dungeons and Dragons movie with Jeremy Irons, Thora Birch, and one of the Wayans brothers. Absolute garbage but I loved it for some reason. I earned some late fees for not returning the VHS on time. Catwoman, 2003, haunted my childhood. I didn't realize the terrible special effects weren't real. So I jumped around my living room trying to imitate her. Edit. I had the Catwoman game on PS2. It was as weirdly bad as the movie. Spy Kids 3D. Game over. Although it is beautiful cringe. The Little Vampire. Blank check. The thought of being rich as a kid made me love the movie when I was younger. Watched it a couple years ago and got some real Predator vibes between the kid and the lady FBI agent. Really hard to watch the ending where they kiss. G-Force. That one Disney movie about the guinea pig spies? I thought that movie was the best as a kid. I got through about 10 minutes of it when I tried to rewatch it a few months ago. Man, that movie is weird. Indian and the Cupboard. No idea why, but I liked it a lot as a kid. Watched it a few years ago with my nephew and hated it. Kiss meets the Phantom of the Park. Edit. Thanks for the award. Ack. Master of Disguise. Loved it as a kid. Holy shit is it a terrible movie. Shark Boy and Lava Girl. That shit was the coolest thing I'd ever seen. My kids were talking about Osmosis Jones today. They were surprised at the lyrics from the song of Kid Rock. I didn't know it was that bad when we would watch it when they were children. Any of the Steven Seagal movies from the late 80s slash early 90s. Junior high school me thought he was the biggest badass ever born. Thinking about that, now that feels like the most neck but fandom ever. Batman and Robin. Reading through these makes me feel really old. Any of the Mary Kate and Ashley movies. Edit. Holy crap I did not expect this one to blow up. I'm going to try my best to reply to what I can. Thanks everyone. I'd like to make it clear that I grew up with these movies, loved the Olsen twins, and there is a lot of nostalgia that comes with the memories of their movies. I just don't think as an adult now they would be as great as I thought they were 20 some years ago. Son of the Mask, I loved the first one and got hyped when I saw there was a sequel. I was the kinda hyped where I brainwashed myself into liking it. Mario Brothers. I was 10. Percy Jackson movies, you read the books, rewatch the movies, and wonder what the hell went so wrong. Not even a kid, the 2002 movie Queen of the Damned. 
I was in my early 20s and thought it was so sexy and cool. I watch it now, and it's so campy and cringy and god bless Aliyah, but her performance was si shlol. Cat in the hat. Now that I think about it, it technically isn't a kid's movie. Legend of the Boggy Creek Monster. I thought it was terrifying as a kid. Then I watched it recently. And it wasn't. Monkey Bone. I seriously thought this movie was just some weird dream I had as a child deep and stuck w me for years. Two of my favorite movies as a kid, Beastmaster, Brian Singer, and Clash of the Titans, Harry Hamlin. I can't remember how many times I watched the VHS tapes, over and over. Tried to watch BM last year, OMFG, it was so bad and we laughed, and then turned it off maybe 10 minutes in. Minor kid died a little. I did not remember it at all the way it happened. Edit, Mark, not Brian. Mortal Kombat Annihilation. I tried to watch it once as an adult, and turned it off after 15 minutes, cause it made cringe too hard. Any of the first three Spy Kids movies. I remember the second one being one of my favorites and now it's genuinely painful. The Covenant. It was a relatively early Sebastian Stan movie that I was obsessed with in middle school. I rewatched it a few years ago, and it is easily one of the worst acted movies I've watched. Definitely the worst I've seen in a good decade. I really thought those guys were so cool. I just cringe thinking about how often I watched it and convinced myself that it was even halfway good just because there were hot guys. Robot Jarks. Didn't listen to it for like 15, 20 years. I regret rewatching it, ruined my nostalgia. Critters. It was fun and cheesy though. Probably Surf Ninjas. Still love that movie though. Masters of the Universe with Dolph Lundgren.